Hey guys, welcome back to some more Bioshock Infinite. This is a toolbox. I'm sorry, I changed around some of my keys. I kind of swapped uh, the lane, whatever. Anyways, uh, so let's just loot over here. We unfortunately have a turret right here, and um, the turrets are not actually on my team, as you could probably imagine. Uh, and that I, I have to use like a lot of my salts in order to take it over. So I think this one I may skip out on. So I'm just gonna wait until he's turned in a way where I can't uh, can't get me as easily. That's it. We don't have to deal with him at all. What? Okay. Hey. <laughs> this is still. It's still just brutal. It really is. I'm gonna hold out up here because I don't want to take that much damage. So that guy tripped. So the pistol I found to be a very nice early sniping weapon. There's no like health regeneration mechanic as of yet. Uh, there will be later. Spoiler, but it's just introducing you to the mechanics of the game. You got lots of pistol ammo too. So some of them start with pistols. I'm gonna start like looting these corpses. Apparently people are having like stutter issues with this game, but I didn't really have any trouble. Yeah, see what I mean? It, it fires at me. What I'll have to do is kind of just dodge it, you know. I don't wanna I don't wanna waste salt, so. I'm kinda curious to see what's down there. See, the turret is right there, so. But, you know, if I, if I, if I kind of, like, go in correct directions, I can kind of avoid it and not have to use up the salts so early on. I think I've been here before, because this purse I recognize. Yeah, I recognize this area to begin with anyway, so. I think I looted most of the crap here. Maybe I shouldn't have looted all the food. So if you need to, uh, there's a guy here that sells stuff. We obviously don't need it. There's another turret right there, uh, which is why I kind of saved my salts a little bit. Uh, so I would be able to, wouldn't have any trouble. So what I basically do is now I take it over, and now we just kind of continue on our merry way. And it will give us, it'll give us some turret support. So I'm playing, uh... I'm going to warn you in advance, I'm probably going to I'm probably gonna play in a way that's very methodical and careful, I hope. Uh, if I don't, then whatever. That's that's my attempt at least. Oh, look, more bread. What? I, I, can't, I loot the entire compartment here? Alright. My hand is very interesting. Tons of money. What was I looting here? I, I, I seriously want to know. Was it like something over here? Oh, we don't really know. Um, I don't know what I think about the plot so far, because there are some gaping plot holes already, like, you know, why was he idiotic and showed people his hand when he knew, you know. Could have used his left hand or something, unless it's, like, evil as well. Uh, but, you know, I don't mind that, because I like gameplay and environment. If it has those two things, I can give half a rat's ass about the plot. Uh, but we'll see how it develops as we continue. Well... That's pretty much it for provisions. It's getting hot. What's going on? So this is a fireman. I don't really need accuracy, it's like right there. So it's simple, at least I, as far as I can tell, it's mostly about the dodging here. Oh. Uh, <laughs> uh oh. Turned right there. That's unfortunate. Okay, um. Where did he drop the vigor? It's right there. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna just, uh. Hey, turret. Taking you over. Alright. Well, you only live once. Press to throw a fiery grenade. 
hold and release to create an explosive trap. <coughs> that wasn't no sin. Uh, so I throw it, and I can also make it a trap a bit. Let's be a little bit more. Uh oh. Uh, we can go find some hell somewhere. I think there's some over here. Or maybe not. Come on. Oh, barely some hell. I think I could dispatch this guy from long range. It, it, it mixes this nice sniping weapon. It's got, it's like a pistol with a bit of personality. Reminds me of like a German pistol. I, I'm pretty sure someone knows the name. This guy looked pretty alive. I'm heading up here. Oh, more health. Thank goodness. Oh, the fireworks. Nice. I probably should use the environment a little bit more. So it's telling me I can hold V. This is the uh, this is like the uncool way of doing it. I, I I could just do it with like one and two to switch between these things. It's much easier that way. Some cool mechanics so far. Obviously, this is like the slit the it the uh, oil. I'm guessing I can set that on fire. I don't want to really waste my my vigors because you don't get a whole lot. I got some more salts, but like seriously. Also, that was really cool how he just kind of exp he exploded and I got thrown off the entire thing. That was so sweet. Alright. And there's some more uh, ammunition for us. I think that's it. Oh, wait. There's a purse here. I kind of like just exploring the environment here. It's, it's nice. Holy shit, they have bacon here. Oh man, this is going to be my favorite place in the whole game, I can already tell you. I love bacon. So, let's see, what's what do cigarettes do? They give me salt for, for the exchange of health. And uh, alcohol does the exact opposite. So it's exactly like uh, in all the other games. Uh, well, Bioshock, System Shock, and all that. Well, System Shock didn't do that with cigarettes. Okay, we're gonna leave the area. We have a fair bit of uh, movies to watch here. Back to opening day. it. Okay, let's try this one. Oh man, these old timey films, what will they think of next? Moving pictures. <laughs> Oh, there's salts here. Oh, we have maximum salts though. Uh, we don't want to quite leave. Let's go. Let's go. Um, you know, hang our coat up or something. Dude, this is my favorite place. Oh shit, it's alcohol and money. Give me another drink, bartender. Okay. Wow, that took a lot out of me. I should really be careful. Well then. Okay, I think we're good. Oh wait, no oh, cabinet. Had some something. Okay. Well, let's see what's in the r blue ribbon here. We do indeed. Why are you following me? We were only here. Why are 
you following us. I, I... Adds a mag magic, um, magnetic repulsive field to improve defense. What was that? Surprising. Surprising that it worked? Surprising that it didn't kill him. But a magnetic repulsive field around one's body can come in handy. If it doesn't kill you. A fair point. So that's the regenerating health mechanic I was talking about before. So it's, um... This is how they kind of, um... If you haven't noticed, there's, there's no... I don't see any kind of option for med packs in this. I haven't picked up anything. I just pretty much just eat the health immediately. And I'm just running around with the pistol uh, the entire time. Wow, you really don't have anything else here? I don't, I don't want I don't want whiskey. I think I'm good. Just kind of want to look around. These two characters, I swear. Also, you can kill NPCs. Um, they usually will have negative effects, but... Uh, so that's why you probably don't want to do them. Like, you know, it may be important or something. I don't know, but I've noticed I've been able to kill them and it doesn't care. Most of the time, it doesn't care. Oh, it's this one. Father Comstock called on me today to write his biograph. Me. The man pays for exactly 100 pages in advance. Now, I'm half a Jew when I smell silver, so I say, I say, Father... Your flock would pay for a thousand. You know, well, I'd settle for less. And then the prophet looks to me and says, One hundred will suffice, as I know how it ends. Damn it, it keeps taking stuff from salts. What is this? Oh, it is beer. Oh, whatever. I like this these blimps and things like that. Just kind of cool. Anyways, we get uh, introduced to a new mechanic. Oh! Damn hook must be magnetized. <laughs> and I just want to look over here. I don't think I've ever really looked around here. Like machine gun ammo. Alright. Hopefully that's not going to make any of you dizzy. And we can hold to pick up a machine gun. So, uh, we get two weapons now. Delicious, delicious weapons. And, uh, this is... Uh, so yeah, we only get two throughout the entire game as far as I understand. I haven't actually seen anything else beyond this. Uh, but this is a pretty powerful weapon, and so I like using this to, like, snipe Get people. Over here. Oh. Because this is more accurate. And so, like, you can see, like, my little yellow bar there is the, the little shield thing, and then it goes back up, so there's a nice little indicator on the screen as well, the one that occurs. It looks like we're against, like, military guys, so... If you still feel the need to, go set them on fire. It distracts them. Oh, you want to see the new weapon, probably, so let me go show you guys. We're now Call of Duty. So it's kind of a good idea, I guess, to wait for this to come back up. Alright, let's go loot some of these bodies. There's also a machine gun over there. I can't quite see it properly. We'll just head over here for a sec. You can also throw a, a thing at it. The machine gun is mo much more effective against it. Like, it'll actually kill it. The, the pistol won't, no matter how much you fire. That's why I like to save those the, the ammunition for that. 
All right, we got we got a good amount of things. Oh, the bird! Uh, can, I, can I shoot down the bird? No. That makes me sad. All right, let's just go get everything we need. This is a difficulty where we will probably need to loot everything humanly possible. It's a good idea either way. I figure, you know, I shouldn't just run through everything and skip it. I should kind of like stop and smell the roses. Also, the environment. I love how those things look. It's like a, it's like a we steampunk future. I love it. Okay, apparently, birds are impervious to bullets. Oh god, I missed that. It's still there. So it might be in our best interest here to to take over the turret when we see it. Uh, some whiskey. You want a drink? I, I don't know if the zooming in makes it any more accurate. Uh, let's go drink some health packs. That's what we'll drink. See, I can, I can, I can headshot them pretty well, actually. But clearly a turret sees me. I'm not really getting into any kind of melee range. Oh, by the way, I think, uh... Oh, I thought you could decapitate them afterwards. Okay, so there is a turret there. Let's go take it over. There we go. Now they have something a little bit more to worry about other than just me. <laughs> oh my... Really? Really, game? That's... That's just too funny. Oh, it looks like the tur You see what I mean? The turrets are very timed. It's very short time. I, um, if you're wondering what the 1990, dip uh, 1999 difficulty does, it makes things a hell of a lot harder. There's no UI. I haven't actually played this on any other difficulty other than 1999 mode, because that's... Obviously, the first difficulty I want to be doing. Alright, so I'm gonna switch up. Let's go over here and throw a bomb at it. Okay, looks like it's down. I'm running out of pistol ammo, so I think I gotta use this a bit more. Or my melee, but I haven't really had many opportunities for melee. Uh, an apple there. And my gun appears to be stuck in this position. Or not. Okay. Anyway, I can jump on this ship. Oh, hell yes, I can. I don't think I could make it onto the other one, but uh, maybe, maybe if you parkour up. This is kind of fun. Alright, let's jump down here. Looks like the bodies disappear rather quickly, so it like, uh, I don't know what it does. Kind of just like looking down at this, this crap. Well, uh, I could carry on this way, however, uh, there's actually, uh, something you can do. Uh, actually, I don't even know if you can, yeah, you can continue on that way. By the way, this is exactly where I left off, pretty much, I kind of went into here and that was it. Um, so, uh, from now on, it is actually now entirely blind. I don't, I don't, I have no idea what I'm doing anymore. Mm, salts. I explored here a bit, I'm like, yeah, I'm ready. Or no, no, wait, maybe not. Oh, no, 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 sorry, it's, I, I still have a bit more to go. But there is, um, there's a gentleman down here. It's all right, I'm not like the rest. I'm a progressive. Oh, are you? That's nice. <laughs> it doesn't care. 
I, I don't know what it'll do. Maybe like later on, I'm just it's not gonna let me have any. Um, it's not gonna give me any resources or something. I don't know what it's gonna do. It's kind of fun though. But we did. We'll take all this candy. Am I a bad person? I, I think I'm just misunderstood. I'm not bad. And so they, here they have their uh, their washroom, and a very large scale. And obviously some health and monies. Otis works up at the lodge part time. He took this box from one of their secret ceremonies. And I know for sure there is something dear inside. Problem is, Otis is more fool than not. He didn't bother. Optional quest will give you an opportunity. Stay alert. Or but care. also secure a key from the Feathered Brothers to open the damn thing. Wait a second. He said it. Otis works up at the lodge part-time. He took this box from one of their secret ceremonies. And I know for sure there is something dear inside. Problem is, Otis is more fool than not. He didn't bother to also secure a key from the Feathered Brothers to open the damn thing. Okay. So we have to find a key and then come back, come straight back here. Maybe we'll get some good resource, some nice resource. Although I love this little jumping thing. It's actually a lot of fun, uh, but you know it kind of gives an illusion of speed, which should probably it's probably not very. I wish I could jump up here. Oh well. And I, I would certainly be breaking a leg or something. Guess I might as well go take this uh, health. Oh, more money. It, the thing is, though, the reason I need so much money is that uh, I have to secure because whenever I die, I, I lose, I lose uh, money basically. guys I'm not gonna kill them because I, I I would think that uh it's not gonna be my best interest uh when they when they uh hear me okay I guess we'll carry on over here eh, cigarettes and here's Lincoln a lot of old-timey stuff Well, I guess we'll uh, we'll carry on next time. So we'll uh, ooh machine gun and it's salt, but my salt is full. We'll carry on next time through these doors. Next time, see you later.